Well, how you doing, everyone? Josh the Collector Guy. Hope you all had a great week this week, ladies and gentlemen. Hope you picked up some great additions for your collection. Well, this is the haul for the week, ladies and gentlemen. Got some pretty cool 2014 in-store finds to share with you very soon. Awesome collector's case. Some black walls, red lines, and even some carded vintage cars as well. Really, really awesome. And two awesome Camaros as well. Cali Customs, and even some stuff I bought for Dad over the weekend as well. And stick around at the end, everyone. Got the one custom for the week, so I hope you all like it. Stay tuned for that. Well, as I just mentioned, new 2014s have been popping up in the shop. Awesome Corvette Stingray, had to get that. As you know, I love my Chevs. I've gone absolutely crazy over these Copos. So crazy, I've had to crack one open to stop the craziness. We've got the international long card, got the short card, and I've got the USA long card somewhere. So I hope that's all the va card variations. Pretty happy to find one. Find them, I mean. But this one's quite, quite different. The casting's not that good there, as you can see. On the roof. I had to pick it up because I, I class it as an error. I love my errors, so that's a good one for the collection. It being a Camaro too. I don't mind that. Got some... Oh, I'll get the dad stuff as well. Old Highway Hauler 2. New one for this year. Well, next year I should say. 2014. But we'll be saying this year for it very soon. Really love the colour combination. Red and the blue. Really good colour combination. I like it a lot better than the first edition. Really nice truck though, it's grown on me a lot. At first I really was a bit iffy about it, but it's a really nice truck, really awesome. I still reckon it should be called Highway Hauler 3, because realistically there's been three versions of the Highway Hauler, but that's my opinion. And picked that up a Ma Tokyo Mater Chase, Termator, in the Perspec case, really awesome. Wild wing on the back, really cool find do like the Cars Cars. This series though is great, great detail. I've got my Daryl Wall Trip one somewhere up on my up on my desk there. That's a pretty cool one. Great series though as I just said and great they have chase cars as well. Well, got some Cali Customs up next everyone. Love the Cali Customs series. Love the old Chevy. Pretty sure it's a C10 or an S10. Love the green and love them wheels as well. All complete there with the stickers and the hockey puck or whatever you want to call it. Really cool set. I pick up a, as much of these as I can. And a really tough looking 57 Chev. How awesome is that with the stickers and the hockey puck. Oh, blown 57 Chev. How awesome. Got a vintage hot, well, carded Corvette right here. It's a different card variation to the one I have. The one I have has got new model plastered right there. So it's good to have a different one. Old number, number 88 Corvette, like Dale Jr.'s number in NASCAR. Old opening bonnet too, and the briefcase in the back. Pretty good detail for back then. Had to put her in the protector pack as well. Got some other ones here. Two awesome, awesome caddies. Love old, the old Cadillac Seville, love that car. Typical Cadillac fashion, really, really big cars. The other Cadillac looking town car thing. Classic caddy. Like an old, like a creamy sort of colour. Really awesome models. This one for card variation. I don't, I don't think I said it. It's got the sticker there. The one I have doesn't have the sticker, so it's a good card variation. Oh, variations! You gotta love them. Two blown Z28 Camaros. Two variations, of course, with the blue there in the tampo and the purple there in the tampo. I was really excited to pick them up, and even the. Cards are a variation with new model there and no new model there. One's punched and one's unpunched. Well, one's unpunched and one's been punched. So, oh boy. Variations, they never end, do they? Old highway patrol car. Unfortunately, I ate half the card on the way home. No, just kidding. It was already damaged like that, but that doesn't matter. Pretty cool to see it on the old pack, old card like this, old packet. Love the card art as well. They did a fantastic job back then with it. A little bit fluffy around the sides, but that doesn't bother me at all. Really nice police car as well. Not sure what it's based on. It's probably a Ford or a Dodge. Or a Chevy. Got the old black walls up next. The old Firebird funny car. Really awesome. Not too bad condition as well. Love the old flame job on her. 
pick up as much of these funny cars as I can. I love my drag racing. Stage front. I don't know how you're going to drive it though. Missing steering wheel. But this is the second one I've ever found. Really nice model. Really, really cool model. Love the design. It'd be cool if it was real as well. Old swap van. Old scene machine. It's got the the scene in the back there where you can sort of see it. See it. It's got an old Ge German Shepherd barking at you. Better not look too long, otherwise he'll come after you. That's a really cool model. The old Combat Medic. Whatever it's called. There's so many names for it in the Tom Martz book. It's unbelievable. Really awesome to pick that up. Got some awesome, awesome red lines here. Old Chrome Super Van. Love it. Love the flames on the side as well. The Chrome's in good condition as well. Still rolls not too bad as well. Old Paddy Wagon. Love this model. Absolutely love it. Glad to have it on the as a red line now I should say awesome model pretty sure it's designed by Tom Daniel as well have to have a look old Corvette I love my vets love my Camaros but glad to pick this one up my favorite color too Hong Kong base I got a USA one floating around somewhere so it's good to get the variation of the country as you can see black steering wheel sort of creamy white interior someone put a sticker there unfortunately it didn't come off properly but I didn't pull it off anyway. So, love the Corvette. Awesome model. I believe it was out in the stores before it was out as a real car back in the day as well. Would have been cool to see anyway back then. Probably would have caused a lot of hype as well. Really nice car. Love my vets. An old strip teaser. The old 1973 Shell Promotions one. In enamel yellow. Really nice. Unfortunately does not have the inter interior. But I'm pr still pretty happy with that. Really awesome casting. Wasn't really released too often, really. The, the big blown engine, look at that. I don't know how you're going to see going down the drag strip. Good luck. Really awesome. And that leaves my collector's case. Love the artwork on this. Love it. Old construction work. Old NASCAR Dodge there. And beautiful doozy. Love that car. It's in pretty, pretty good shape. As you can see, well, it's a bit worn a bit there that doesn't really matter other than that it's in pretty pretty darn good condition in my opinion she'll well put a lot of my old stuff in here that's for sure store a few of them away because there's a few floating around that's for sure need to put them away in this case to be protected so that's a great addition to the collection always great to have some old collector's cases well that's the haul everyone so what does that leave the custom? Well, I hope you like what I've done this week, ladies and gentlemen. I'll put that down so you can see you're on here. So I hope you like what I've done this week, ladies and gentlemen. It's pro probably one of my biggest ones yet. Not bigger than these monster trucks, but probably bigger than a lot of work done. But I hope you like everyone. I'll show you what it is. Old Bone Breaker, my mum likes to call her. And also, that's her name now, too. Well, she's got the Altered State base on her. On her, I had to cut up the bone shaker a little bit just a few things here and there but she she fits pretty good on it old wild blown chev engine of course out the bonnet an old hard top bone shaker had to use that old real riders as well well i hope you like the custom everyone let me know what you think i really do appreciate your feedback as i always say in my videos but that's pretty much it for the week everyone I hope you enjoyed. I thank you very much for tuning in each and every week, everyone. I really do appreciate it. Thank you for commenting. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for liking my videos. I really do appreciate it. Well, that's it, everyone. Hope you enjoyed. Thank you very much for watching again. And as always, everyone, happy hunting. Keep the hobby strong. See you later, everyone. Have a great week.